a 10 to 25 Lumix f1.7, a Sapphire lens, and this is a Micro Four Thirds mount, um, yeah, f1.7 version. Basically, this is the newest Lumix lens they released last year in 2015. I believe this is the pouch. What's inside? So we got the pouch here. Pretty big size. The size is pretty big. And we got the manual. Here, I'm not going to figure it out. And spot. So we got <clears throat> we got a tray here. On top of the tray is the lens hood, which says uh, the caliber is 77 millimeters. So uh, the diameter of the lens is pretty big. I have a Lumix G9 here, so relatively the body seems a little bit smaller when it's mounted to the 1025. So basically, the 1025 is a pretty big lens. Here I have the Sigma, a Sigma uh, 18 35. So, and I have a GH5 here. So, let's do a comparison. Removing the lens hood, just wanna be fair. And normally, I don't use the lens hood that often. So here is a side by side comparison. Uh, basically, you can tell the Lumix is definitely uh, shorter and lighter than the Sigma. And in terms of the focal lens, after the speed booster, I got a speed booster uh, 0.64x. After the speed booster, the Sigma can go all the way to f1.1 versus the Lumix can only go to f1.8. And basically the difference between two lenses is the Lumix is weather shield and the uh, uh, Sigma is not. And neither of the lenses has OIS and this is a side comparison. From from here you can tell uh, the um, Sigma is slightly longer than the Lumix by around one inch and of course Sigma is way heavier plus the metal bones so by holding the Sigma I can I think is maybe four ounce difference three ounce difference something like that so you, basically you can tell the difference I would say for the gimbal user definitely the Lumix is a better option since after without speed booster you got a lighter, lightweighted and at the meantime uh, the focal lens you got a wider field of view. 
definitely the Sigma after the speed booster you are still getting like 12 or 13 millimeters versus the Lumix you are getting 10 millimeters the Lumix is wider even though it's not as fast as the Sigma f1.1 this guy uh, can only do f1.7 yeah, the Lumix is 25 and the Sigma is 28 so the tail end they are almost identical but wide end the Lumix is way better here we got f1.7 believe it or not this guy we got f1.1 so definitely the Sigma is way faster than the Lumix at the meantime the Lumix is like lighter and more convenient and it's wider and it's good for vlogging versus the Sigma in terms of vlogging is a little bit too heavy definitely that couple ounces difference it, uh, it matters um, Sigma is 72 I believe and uh, Lumix is 77 so the Lumix is a little bit slightly bigger than the Sigma uh, by the way I have a valuable anti filter installed to the Sigma but I don't have nothing on the Lumix yeah that's about it alright thanks for watching if you like this video please like subscribe and turn on the notification bell I will see you guys next time peace